Hi guys, my name is Gaurav and I am here to give a short review of the Oreo based ROM which is known as AOSP Extended version 5.2 for Lenovo Z2 Plus. So let's get start. Uh, so this is a ROM which is mainly based on Android uh, Android 8.1 which is the latest version of the Android you can see here it is uh, uh, now currently running 8.1 uh, it is an AOSP extended uh, 5.2 official ROM with the latest security patch of uh, 5 February in 2018 so it has all the security uh, patches updated uh, now in terms of the specifications the phone is powered by snapdragon 820 processor which is an quad core processor uh, the clock speed of the processor is 2.515 GHz. It is a uh, flagship processor of 2015, so it is pretty fast. Uh, so, in terms of screen size, the phone is uh, about 5 inches and it has 1080p of a screen and it has 4 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of internal storage. Uh, in terms of battery capacity, it has 3500 MHz uh, battery. So it's pretty good battery uh, for uh, one day use. So in terms of the battery backup, the phone has pretty much good battery backup. Uh, the phone lasted for about six hour uh, till full charged. Uh, I have not used very heavy applications. I have only used YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and uh, etc. Small apps. Uh, it is. Uh, all the apps are working on 4G connection so it is um, we can say that uh, the battery backup is pretty good uh, as uh, compared to a uh, stock ROM uh, you can see here the Volti is also working uh, very good I can use proper Volti uh, so you can use a geo sim in this uh, device So uh, now in terms of the performance, the phone is uh, pretty good in performance. Uh, not as good as stock ROM, but it has still some bad, uh, bad uh, benchmark score as compared to stock ROM. You can see I have tested until the benchmark. It has got 16, uh, 1,65,392. Uh, so it is an latest version of Antutu to benchmark. So we cannot say it is a bad score or good score. Uh, when the ranking list will come mm, we can see the benchmark scores now it is not uh, showing so it is pretty much good score uh, now we can see that uh, about benchmark score of Geekbench so the Geekbench uh, I have tested so in multi core it, it it got says 1700 something that score and uh, multi core benchmark of about 4560 which is pretty much good uh, it is uh, pretty much same uh, score uh, of one plus three so you can see uh, i can skip this uh, test so now let's get a test about of internet connection you can see I have connected the phone with Wi-Fi. And the downloading speed of uh, this phone, this room, sorry, is not pretty much well like a uh, stock ROM uh, in stock ROM I, I have I've got a, a speed around 62 mbps and uh, uploading speed about the same, uh, same so we can test again to ensure that uh, the run has uh, the test has ran properly or not still it has only uh, 44 mbps of speed uh, so in terms of the internet uh, it has not good uh, as stock ROM but still 
pretty much good mm, okay so in terms of the ui this rom has very good uh, theme engines the rom work like butter it has no lag or hanging issue you can see uh, it has many it has many customization like uh, theme engines uh, etc so here i can show you you can change the, the that dot color uh, from this device theme and we have ui styles also you can change it to light ui dark ui black ui and etc this is the dark ui i can change it to light ui you can see here so in terms of the uh, ui the phone has very very good performance it is no lag issue and no uh, shutter and uh, nothing glitches at all in in this uh, uh, room all the functions are the features are working like Wi-Fi Bluetooth uh, internet connection hotspot and uh, etc are running very good uh, so let's talk about camera the camera of this phone is pretty much good you can see UI also changed so the camera is also working very well uh, with no issues uh, and uh, in this room some extra features are added like face lock uh, and this customization like uh, PIP mode and etc so the room has very good features with no issues no bugs I have only noticed one bug in calling feature only uh, when I used to call someone, uh, it can it, it it call very very pretty much well. But in uh, con at a time of conference call, the phone uh, so uh, show sometime issues like uh, the UI lags or the phone call ends, etc. So there is only one bug I have seen in uh, in this room. Uh, so this room is pretty much good. You can use. If you want to use and uh, ex use or experience the Android 8.1 uh, UI or uh, anything you want to use, it's a pretty much uh, good ROM. All the features are working very very good. Ah, uh, and the sound or quality also uh, very good of, of this room, and uh, heat issues are there in this uh, room when we can we play heavy games like asphalt and spandry art the phone heats up uh, in normal internet usage the phone doesn't uh, heats up but in heavy like you are using 4 you are using internet from 4g connection for long time uh, like one hour two hours so it gets heat up very fast and very 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 heat very heat up very very good So you can use this room uh, as you want, uh, thank you and have a nice day.